What's up, y'all? Welcome back to our channel. It's Wednesday, the 5th, my daddy's birthday. Just waking up. It is 5.57. Oh, my watch came. It keep up my blood pressure and my heart rate and stuff. Um, so I'm about to find Shada some socks, but she had like, she just not in the mood. Let me move this out of the way. She had like, she just not in the mood to find her own socks. Oh, my socks and her socks. I'm about to find some socks. That's what he said, he's talking. I honestly think they be mixing their socks together. Who bring me a sock thing? I honestly just need to go through and put their matches together. That's probably what I do today. Like find all the matches. I should have been doing that. I'm, I want to be so organized so bad, but I seem to can't get it together. I'm just trying to go ahead and get dressed. Today is already starting to fly. Um, my husband got up. Well, he probably slept maybe an hour because he was up in the game room. And he had to leave and go to work. So when he left, they woke me up. So I was up at two. I went back to sleep about four, 4.20. And woke back up at 5.45. So I am a little tired. Um, I'm not really doing anything today. So it's gonna be like a, I'm probably sleep today. Catch up on some sleep, cause I'm tired. But yeah. I'm about to help her get ready and I'll pull y'all back up. What's up y'all? So I just got a call from the school and the school, well, the school didn't even, like, call me. It was, like, a voice recorder basically saying that, why would you do that? <sighs> basically saying that somebody in Charlotte class had COVID-19 and she was exposed to that child. And if she has symptoms, I could, eat, I could choose to keep her home or send her to school. Like, when the freak is it okay to send kids? Still seeing kids to school with COVID. Like, what is going on? And they didn't even call me. They sent a voice recording to my phone to let me know my child has been exposed to another child with COVID. And it's crazy because they sent it to me right when Shada is getting on the bus. So not only is y'all just okay, Shada got like 21 kids in her class. So 21 students. A child exposed to COVID. Then y'all putting these kids on the buses to expose other kids on the bus. So, you know, now I got to inform the bus driver because I'm going to do that and let them know what is, let her know what's been. They get, they on the bus, baby. That, you know, somebody in her class has been exposed to COVID and. They sitting up there, wait all late and to let me know what's going on. So, you know, I got my other daughter who, you know, shot to sit with on a bus, my older daughter. 
So now I'm gonna probably have to quarantine her to watch her to make sure she not getting sick because Shawna have to quarantine. So it's like at this point, I am just like so over it. Like the kids have learned nothing this year. Well, last year. I feel like they was out more than they was in and I just I'm just so frustrated with this and with these schools with this COVID. What baby? No, you can't take that off. Yeah, that you can't take that off. She missed with her helmet. But ever go cut your tablet off if you're not using it. But I'm just so over this stuff with this COVID and these teachers. It's like they don't, the schools act like they don't care. They wait until the last minute to let parents know what's going on. Because if my kid was exposed to COVID from somebody in her class, I feel like instead of them sending a voice record, and I feel like y'all need to be calling parents and letting them know, hey, it was a student with COVID and that student exposed this classroom. Like, these kids was around this student. Not seeing a voice recorder and when she about to get on the bus. Because if y'all had time to send out a whole voice re recording to her whole class, y'all could have easily called the parents and let them know, hey, just come get your child because they've been exposed to COVID and we need to make sure all the other kids are safe. But, whatever. I'm going to let everybody know and I'm keeping my kid home. And then I'm going to keep my oldest daughter home. Just to quarantine her to make sure she don't get sick and every goddamn on thing else. And then we were supposed to go to my niece was supposed to be coming Friday. I don't know if she coming Friday still. Um we were supposed to go to a birthday party. My um shot of god mom daughter birthday um is Saturday. We were supposed to go to that, and I don't even know. If I want to go because Shada has <clears throat> been exposed to COVID. So I have to let everybody know that, you know. That's crazy. But I just wanted to rant about that, y'all. Mm -hmm. What's up, guys? Welcome back to our channel. So it is 8.37 in the morning. I've been up since like 7.30. My mom woke me up. I gave her some Jordans that I only wore once that I wasn't going to wear anymore because we were the same size. I think I remember telling y'all that in the vlog. But she couldn't find them, and she thought that I gave her an empty box. How? How, boo? But anyway, I'm up. Shada is up. She's wanting cereal because her dad brought them some candy eggs, so she really trying to get candy eggs. Also, update on Shada. Um, yesterday, she started running like a little fever, and I gave her medicine, and it um, it broke. It you know, she didn't have it anymore. But what? What? No, you're not. But anyway, she had a fever and it broke yesterday. Well, she didn't have like a fever. She was just getting she was getting warm. She was feeling warm. But I gave her medicine. I gave all the girls medicine um yesterday. Ava is still asleep. I think Alega is up. Not sure. But I think I'ma eat cereal too. Cause I only I only drink um almond milk. Yeah. She just blinked. <laughs> she just blinked at me. So yeah, I just I washed my hair last night. I'm actually about to retwist it. Normally, normally my husband will retwist my hair, but. He hadn't been a good sport because my hair has been looking like this. Every day? Yeah. And I'm just, <laughs> I'm over it. I don't want it looking like this anymore. So I'm actually about to retwist it. Y'all see? 
I'm about to just go ahead and retwist it. But, um, so we brought these cereal. We were supposed to eat these cereal during Vlogmas, the elf cereal. But, y'all, we never even, yeah, we never even got around to eating the cereal. I don't know where my, um, my tripod at. I think it's in my car. And my husband drives the car to his big, normally he'll drive the truck. So he been normally he'll drive the truck to his big truck, but he been driving the he car. Like yeah, I think. Um, so I never he get up so early, which that ain't an excuse because I could have been got it out of there. But y'all, this is how the cereal look. So we just gonna go ahead and eat these. Y'all gonna go ahead and pour you some milk. We gonna go ahead and eat some cereal. Because the reason why I'm not cooking y'all, I cooked yesterday morning and I cooked them eggs and sausage and I cooked um, toast as well. But no, nobody didn't really eat their food. Alea, you know, ate um, some of her food. But I had ended up cooking me some, I did toast, avocado toast with um, eggs. So, but I did avocado toast with eggs and it was pretty good. That was my first time trying it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's trying to let me go to call. I don't know. So, we gonna eat cereal today. What is this? Mm. You know, I don't want to eat I don't really care for him. It looked like <laughs> it looked like apple jacks, but it put me in the mind of Lucky Charms. Like not even the marshmallows, just the, the flavor. But Ale hasn't been around anybody. Of course I'd be running the little girls because I still have to do stuff for them. But Ale just laying in the bed here. And my baby, she kind of up. Hey, Dinky. Why you got this pillow on you? You cold? You need to put your cover on you. Your cover on the floor. Y'all, I cleaned up Ava and shot a room and look it. They closet still clean though. This room just always messy. But I had straighten up. I try to I keep the house clean. Like I keep I straighten up the house. I keep the house clean and like the kitchen I keep the kitchen clean those dishes in the sink are clean and of course I keep my room clean cuz I'm never in here but yeah so I'm about to eat my my cereal and then I'm gonna start twisting my hair and I probably will film a little bit of me twisting my hair don't know how I'm going to twist it back just yet. Dang, you know, I just thought about something. I think I brought some um, some of the stuff that I twist my hair with, and it's in my freaking car. I'm going to have to go get some more from the store this morning. But it's cool because I'm retwisting my hair today. So, But I'll pull y'all back up. <laughs> Mm-hmm.
What y'all doing? Well, we can't find a turtle. Y'all can't find a turtle? Well, y'all, I don't kind of, I was starting my hair, but I think I'm twisting it the wrong way. Uh, I don't really know how to do it. My husband said he's going to do it when we come home. Because I don't ever t twist my hair. He always twists my hair. But, update with Shada. She's playing fine. Like, that's how it be, though. Um, My niece and nephew, my niece and my nephews got COVID. But well, they didn't get it from Shada. Shada wasn't around any of them. Um, they mom had it, and then they ended up um, catching it. So, and everybody's different. Some people show symptoms, some people don't. And my nephew is showing symptoms, but he tested positive. So, but I know um, Shada had that little fever yesterday. Well, she was warm yesterday, but I've been checking her and giving her medicine. And giving everybody else medicine, so. Oh, we can't sit in the cat ball. In the cat ball? Like, <laughs> I'm bored. I don't clean up everything. I mean, the trash got to get took off. Um, Y'all know my you know husband and brother have his truck, so. I'm going to go. I'm going to go find the easy to just go take the trash off. Mom, hmm? I'm going to go find a turtle in the room. Okay. I'm going to stay right here. You want to stay right here? So oh, Avery and Shada playing a layer in the room. I know I look crazy. I'm ready for my hair to get done, honestly, Hi. because it look a me. Hot me. Oh, I had made myself some um mashed potatoes, and I put um ketchup on top. Don't judge me. That's what I. That's what I eat. So. I'm about to finish eating my little mashed potatoes. I'm about to finish eating my little mashed potatoes. And... Yeah. The fact that we keep going around in circles about this, like, yeah, you and I talked about this a year ago. And you, and you like me. So, y'all, I just got a girl some medicine, a layer two. I just fixed the little girls. Sandwiches? Yep, sandwiches and um Cheez Its and then they got juice. They both got juice. But Ava love watching her tablet. <laughs> she love watching her tablet and she to be playing with her phone. But they in the room. I just gave her some rubber tussin and I gave the little girl some um so yeah. Yo, I come in my kitchen. This is what I come in my kitchen to. Why is shot a little bus up here? This is what she got for Christmas. They got like a little dog cage. They got the cat in there. Got the little basket, the little doggy bag. They got all the dogs and cats. So maybe this is like a cat and dog bus. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, so as y'all can see, I started twisting my hair but then my husband was like he was gonna finish i think i told y'all that so i stopped twisting my hair and then i started doing ava hair so i'm doing ava hair and box sprays and i'm halfway done i just took a little break so they could eat and i'm about to probably eat me something too maybe a peanut butter and jelly sandwich so yeah now i just got to do the front All right, y'all, so I'm finally finished with Ava hair. And this is how I did it. She got two of these on the, she got one on the other side. And then she got box braids in the bag. And I just wrapped it in a cute little bun, put a bow on it. And then I did the front like this. So this is really cute. She's so cute. And now I'm just about to clean this mess up because it's hair everywhere, it's all over me. Oh, yeah. Alright, what's up y'all? So I know I look crazy. But I just got my hair twisted. 
hubby came through. <laughs> he in there listening to music with the girls in the game room. But I don't mind my face. I just greased it or oiled it or whatever. But uh, my hair is. I'm about to get ready to take these things off. We were supposed to be having a date night tomorrow, but I don't know if we're gonna go because, like I said, Shada is out of school dealing with the COVID thing. She haven't had she haven't had any symptoms. You know, she was warm. Um, but I think I'm gonna just go get her tested in the morning just to make sure if she's clear and good. And then me and hubby is still gonna have our um, date night. So hopefully. She would taste negative. I was about to bake some cookies or something, but I don't even want to um, cookies or bake no cookies. I'm going to just hold off on that stuff. But yeah. I might just try to let this dry a little bit. And I will see you guys in the next vlog.